At the time of the last ice age, interior Alaska was cold, windy, and dry. Permafrost was forming and ice wedges were growing within it. The climate supported grasslands instead of forests. The grass fed several ice age mammals such as the woolly mammoth, the steppe bison, and the Pleistocene horse. The wind blew dust-like silt into the area covering the land. The ground surface slowly raised along with the permafrost. Vegetation remains such as plant pieces, seeds, and pollen were buried and frozen in time inside the permafrost. Evidence of animals were also preserved such as ground squirrel nests. While wetter summers, sometimes mudslides and sinkholes would form. These could bury animal remains, such as bones. Towards the end of the last ice age, the climate started to change. It warmed and became less windy. The ground surface was allowed to become wetter, which supported the growth of trees. Some areas of permafrost thawed. Permafrost areas that remained grew black spruce and moss forests. <laughs>